In this week's Arts and Education, we take you to Sentinel High School, where the Wind Ensembles are preparing for a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. You are looking at and listening to the Sentinel High School Wind Ensemble. This band is audition based, made up of mostly upperclassmen, and they practice together four days a week. So yes, as you would imagine, they are really good. In fact, they are so good, this wind ensemble has been chosen to play in New York City at Carnegie Hall next year. Last year, we went to, to a festival in Southern California and had a lot of success, which helped build a resume for our kids. So I decided to send a tape into this festival. Um, they only take five bands to this particular festival. We're going to five high school bands. and We were selected um, one of those five groups. Along with playing at Carnegie Hall, the students will get the chance to work with several musicians from different colleges across the country, along with performing at an outdoor concert in Central Park. Now a trip like this would be a dream come true for most musicians. And when you ask these kids and their teacher, one word seems to come to mind. This is an honor for anyone if you get to go and play in Carnegie Hall, no matter how old you are, no matter where you live, it's, it's a huge honor. So I'm mainly just honored, I guess, and excited. It's a pretty big honor, honestly, if you think about it, just because of how many people try all their lives to make it to Carnegie Hall, and then we're high schoolers that get to go. Now, whether playing in Carnegie Hall or just sitting with friends in the band room at their high school, art and music can give these kids opportunities they may not have otherwise been able to experience. And this is the thing that senior Andrew McFarlane will miss the most. Most definitely going to miss it. I mean, tuba is an expensive instrument, so I can't really afford one. But just being surrounded by kids that just love to play music, it's, it's something else and I will most definitely miss it when I'm gone. I cannot stop playing music, it's, it's just part of my life. Once you're, once you're a musician in a band, you just, you just play. That's how it is. In Missoula, Louis Storch, MTN News. Now even though the trip is still one year away, the band is already starting to work on the music they will be playing at Carnegie Hall next March. Wow, that's awesome. All the students really excited about it. They say they're nervous, excited, and uh, an honor really because only five bands out of the whole wow. country get to go. Wow. And uh, Sentinel High was chosen as one of those bands. That's awesome that's yeah. locally here. Yeah, that's really great. cool. That's great. Well,